In a lot of ways, uh, Coast is a rough diamond right now. The um, the soil's right, the place is right, the sunshine is right, the weather's right, and those are the four biggest things of the vineyard. And once you get that, you need to uh, start um, kind of honing in and tailoring what you have and what you've planted to that spot. And there's several places in the vineyard, terraces, the Chardonnay at the top of the vineyard, and uh, Casita, top of the big block, the north block, where we've got the right things in the ground. Um, and there's a couple places in the vineyard where um, we've discovered that it's not quite right. And we're really starting to figure out how this place works and um, how we want to uh, uh, really focus what we're doing um, in on the vineyard. Uh, one of the biggest things we want to do is, is get some Viognier in here. It's a place that has fantastic acidity, natural acidity, you know, very rare in California, um, and fantastic aromatics. And so you take a variety like Viognier, which often has acid problems, but has such lovely aromatics, and um, structure problems, you take a place like this where the acid and the structure are always, you know, so kind of front and center, and you can make such a lovely wine. And so we're going to start grafting some things over to Viognier, and then we have an 11 acre uh, a spot of south face and hillside that we're going to terrace up and uh, start planting over the next couple of years. Looking at Viognier there, looking at a little Grenache Blanc, and then uh, trying to decide which red varieties we want to delve into more. Um, we have some areas we've planted that we've grafted over to uh, uh, Grenache and then some cooler lower line areas to Pinot. And we'll watch them as they develop and see, you know, really, you know, our hunch is both those things should do well in the right spots here. But we want to watch them develop and uh, really start tailoring our planting both in terms of uh, variety, selection of varieties and clonal selection and, uh, and rootstocks um, to uh, really help this vineyard kind of reach its, its uh, you know, apogee of expression, if you will. And um, getting closer every year. It's, it's a long process.